Former UFC heavyweight champion, Francis Ngannou, has given his verdict on who he thinks will win the fight between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul. Taking place in November after the original bout was postponed due to Iron Mike's health issues. Many professionals and members of the public have come out stating their concerns about Tyson's health ahead of his clash against the problem. Child, which is set to take place on the 15th of November, even more so after the ulcer flare up. The veteran suffered during a routine flight, which led to the original fight being cancelled. However, Nganu has a different opinion. And he hasn't been afraid to say that opinion to the face of Jake Paul. Being interviewed by Paul himself. On his own podcast, BS with Jake Paul, the Predator was asked his thoughts on the fight, among other topics. Nganu himself made his boxing debut in an impressive performance against Tyson Fury last year, and trained with Iron Mike in the lead-up to that bout. He claims that the 58-year-old has still got it. Due to his allegiance to Tyson, Ngannou was quizzed. On his opinion of the fight by reporters at a PFL media scrum last month, telling them that he thinks. Tyson will beat Paul's A. This led the problem child to challenge Ngannou on the topic when speaking to. Him on his podcast. Jake said, you spoke to some reporter yesterday or the day before, and you said that. Mike Tyson is going to beat my A and Ganu responded without hesitation, saying, I do. Listen, I have seen Tyson move around to show me stuff. And I was like, calm down, he has still got it. We're talking about Mike, bro Mike is something else. He is a specimen. While many only believe that a Tyson win is possible via knockout, Francis Ngannou believes that. The former world heavyweight champion could go all the way and win via points. In an attempt to gain the upper hand over his opponent. Jake Paul asked his guest whether there was anything in particular that he would have to watch out for when facing Mike Tyson. Ngannou responded by saying, you need to watch out for everything. Mike will move from this side to this side without you knowing. In another circumstance, I would be like okay, let's go Jake, but with this I'm like, bro, let's be real. The heavily anticipated fight was due to take place on the 20th of July, however, it had to be postponed due to an injury flare-up sustained by Mike Tyson while on a flight. There are still many people who are concerned at the prospect of a 58-year-old man who may be suffering from serious health. Issues getting into the ring with a 27-year-old who is in the shape of his life. The fight has been sanctioned as a professional heavyweight contest by the Texas Department of Licensing and Registration TDLR, however, there will be a set of modified rules. So that not too much damage is done to old man Mike. Instead of the usual three-minute rounds, there will be a loss of a minute. As eight two-minute rounds will take place instead. The pair will also be using 14-ounce gloves as opposed to the 10-ounce gloves that are standard in a heavyweight bout. The fight is allowed to be determined by knockout, as usual, and the result will be showcased on both fighters' professional records.